Welcome to Century One. In this video, we will cover the data that is available for your use in the Top Commands tab within the Century One Performance Analysis Solution. The Top Commands tab is divided into two sections. The upper section is the grid view. This view contains three tabs. The first tab I will talk about is the Running Queries tab. This tab shows the queries that are currently running on the server regardless of the date and time range selected in the toolbar. The next tab is the Filter tab and it is used to narrow down the display of queries that were collected. In order for the queries to be collected and displayed, they need to run for over one second by default. If you would like to change this default value, you can do so by following these steps. Select the SSAS instance where you would like to make this change from the Navigator pane. Select View and Settings in the menu. Make sure that Top Command Source is selected in the drop-down menu. Change the Inherit from Parent Global setting to False. You can now change the minimum duration setting to your desired value. Please note that you can change the values for collecting the query and plan events here as well. The final tab in the grid view that I will discuss is the completed queries tab. This tab displays all the queries that were collected according to the date and time range specified in the toolbar. Here you can see a list of collected queries and their associated resource utilization. This can help you determine what queries are having the most impact on the performance of your monitored server. The lower section of the top commands tab is the command text section. Within this section, you can see the text data for the query that is selected in the grid view above. For further information on the most used columns available for your use within the top commands tab, please navigate to the following page of our documentation. If you have any questions about this information or you would like further assistance, please navigate to our support website at support.century1.com. Thanks for watching.